What's up guys, I'm going to go over a new feature in Adobe CS6. Uh, this is the content aware move in Photoshop. This is a new feature um, and I found that it works pretty good. Uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to select our bride here and we're going to move her over a little bit with the new content aware move feature. Uh, I found that the best is to kind of don't select too close to them but give it some room to work. So we're going to go ahead and just kind of loosely select around her with our lasso tool like so and then you're gonna find the new content aware move tool is gonna to be located under where your healing brushes are go down and you can see content aware move tool select that uh, it does have some different adaptation options I found that for this uh, particular photo the very strict seems to do the best uh, you'll try different ones and maybe depending on your background uh, it may not blend so well but for this one the very strict seems to work the best so let's just select that and then go ahead and just grab and move her over to where you would like her to be and then just let the tool work its magic and there you go as you guys can see it did a pretty good job of moving her over and uh, kind of filling in the background uh, maybe not totally perfect as you can kind of see through here a little bit and then over here maybe needs a little bit of blending but for the most part uh, you can easily patch this up with a healing brush tool really fast so it does save a lot of time as you can see it generated a lot of background fill here and uh, did, a, did a fairly good job of moving it over at least enough to that's gonna save you a lot of time where you can just go through and clean up these uh, this little section right here which doesn't look the best but as you can see it does save a lot of time and it's pretty easy to use I imagine on something with just a very easy or plain background this tool is probably going to do a lot better job than on a kind of a complex background like this with a lot of trees but either way you can tell that it's going to save you a lot of time and it's pretty easy to use so thanks for watching guys uh, make sure to check out my other photoshop uh, illustrator premiere uh, and after effects tutorials uh, give this video a like if this helped you out and thanks for watching